Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So this is just a slightly different vlog. Well, it's not really different. It's not anything that I don't normally do, but I've just, I'm seeing down. <laughs> um, so I thought I would do a Morrison's haul for you all. So if you've clicked on this video, you already know what the video is about. You probably wouldn't have clicked on it if you weren't interested. <laughs> so I just want to quickly just go through a few things before I get into the haul. Um, I just want to make sure that you all check the app for the scenes. I know I say this time and time again, but don't take my word for it on the sim value because even though it may be correct as of today, it may not be correct tomorrow, next week, in a month's time. Or it could even be incorrect because I've got the scenes wrong and I just want to make sure that you protect your weight loss because, you know, it's going to be your journey and don't go by what other people say sim wise always check the app it's just best thing to do um you will see why as you go through as i go through the hall and you see the hall you'll see why i'm saying what i'm saying i know i'm emphasizing it 10 times more than usual but trust me on this one please 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 check the app beforehand um yeah so that's kind of it really i don't want to harp on about it because I do throughout my video because I've filmed the video already so I just wanted to do a quick little intro just to say but there is you'll you'll understand why I'm saying what I'm saying as you're watching the video um yeah so I shall catch you soon enjoy the video everyone so I'm going to start with the frozen and then move on to the fresh stuff like I normally do so let me begin I've got my scenes sorted as well so i bought some of this corn um southern fried burgers so these are the veggie burgers and they're two and a half seams per burger i then got some of the um morrison's cooked from frozen diced beef this is the one that i normally use to do my peppered beef and they didn't have it last time but as you can see it's actually really quite lean so i was i just found it as protein and free I don't add anything to it because there's not actually any fat there so I think that's pretty good um I then got some of this chicken breast joint that's stuffed with a chicken stage and onion stuffing so this I've worked out 100 grams of this is going to be two seams so that's not too bad I think it's probably the stuffing that is the seamed bit <laughs> Um, I also picked up some more of the Morrison's Naturally Wonky Berries, so I have that with my overnight oats. So you've got blackberries, strawberries, blackcurrants and raspberries in there. I will say the raspberries are just disintegrated raspberries, there is not a sign of one raspberry, but you know, it's fine. It adds to the juice of it. <laughs> um, I also got some, that's all speed by the way. I've got some mango chunks, um, this is frozen too, this is just um, free, it's not speed or anything like that. Because um, I've been ill, I don't know if this is why, but I really fancy orange juice. So I've bought four of these little containers of orange juice. Um, now I know it's seemed, but never mind. So they're, each container is 250 milliliter. So at least it's portion controlled and I won't be drinking the whole lot in one go, let's hope. Um, so it's five scenes for one little pot, which I think is quite high, but, you know, never mind. I'll enjoy it. Um, yeah, I also got some of the Morrison's fat-free natural yoghurt. So this is actually not very thick, it's actually quite runny and I'm normally into thick, but I'm not so keen on thick at the moment for some reason. So I've gone to just a natural yogurt. This is free on the plan. I got some extra thick double cream um, to have with maybe a few puddings that I bought. We'll get to that in a minute. <laughs> anyway, the um, the cream is one level tablespoon is three and a half things. So it's not much. I guess I'll be having this on days when I'm not counting things because... I'm sure I'll end up with more than one level tablespoon because that's not very much. So yeah. Um, I also got some brie. So this is just a French one. Usually my dad buys this but because it's not here. I've not had any. So I normally steal his but I've had to resort to buying my own. <laughs> so never mind. Um, 
So this is a bit of a shame that I don't think Brie is your healthy extra A at all. I, don't, I haven't seen anywhere on the app where it is, so I'm assuming it would have to be seamed. So uh, 25 grams of this is four and a half seams. Now, I couldn't find it on the app, and I've gone by the one that Sainsbury's is doing. They're exactly the same. It says French Brie, cream and mild, uh, mild and creamy. So that's what I've gone by instead of entering it all onto the sink calculator. I have entered some of the stuff on, but this looked a little bit more complicated, so I haven't bothered to do it. But there you go. It's, it wouldn't have worked out correctly, so I just went by one that looked similar. So it did have the stuff, some of the stuff here, but it wouldn't have been enough, I don't think, to get a calculation. So yeah. Um, I also picked up some red grapes to go with my... Brie. <laughs> they're, they're just free. No speed there. Um, some lighter real dairy spray cream. Um, this I've had it before. So you're allowed 20 grams for two and a half things. I can imagine that 20 grams would probably be quite a lot because this is quite light in area. I've never measured it, but I will next time. Um, I also bought this. Now I'll go into the reason why in a minute. Um, so this is Morrison's The Best Sausage and Mash um, with like an ale gravy. So this is 16 and a half scenes. I wish I'd looked <laughs> more closely at the scenes when I was ordering. But the reason why I have bought it is because I wanted sausages, but I didn't want to buy loads of them because I don't want them all the time. And Morrison's do not have the best selection of low-fat sausages. So I decided to buy a ready meal with them in. So whatever it was going to be, I knew it would probably be high, but 16 and a half is ridiculously high. But that's why I bought it. So I'll probably have that today because it's high. Yeah. But yeah, that was the reason why. I just don't want to have bags of sausages of all different sim values. And I don't want veggie ones. I want proper ones. So that's why I did what I did. And then obviously, because I was feeling poorly, I didn't know what I was doing and ordered two lots of bananas. But luckily, I eat quite a lot of bananas anyway. So, yeah, never mind. These ones are slightly riper than those. So, we shall have two bananas a day, I think. <laughs> yeah, so they are basically just free. They are not speed or anything. So, on to the cupboard stuff. So, I got some more mince pies. These are the Morrison's, the best six all butter deep filled mince pies now i tried the other ones and i don't like them as much as these ones so i bought some more of these um i don't think they had the other ones but i really wanted to try some that irene has been talking about they're the lattice filled fruit ones from morrison's but i've not been able to get them but i think they might be less scenes i think i'm not sure how many but these ones are 13 scenes per mince pie which is reasonably high, but they're pretty good. So I bought another packet of those. Um, I got some Dairy Milk Freddo Caramel Bars. Now these used to be less things. So these are now the same as just the normal Dairy Milk without the caramel. So these are now five things per bar. I remember when they used to be four and a half. So that's how I always say, always check the app because they change. The same values clearly change. <laughs> um, also, I bought some of this Bon Mamere strawberry conserve. As you've seen, I've been having it on my toast, in my rice pudding. And I've nearly finished the pot I had, or the jar I had of it, shall I say. So I didn't check the app because I only checked it the other day. But I'm hoping it's not changed. But um, one level tablespoon is half a sin of this, which I think is pretty good. I also got some Marmite because, as I said, I had no Marmite and I thought that would be a good idea. I didn't check if it had any seams because it's usually seam free, so I hope that is still the same. I'm pretty sure it would be though. Um, I picked up some of the Mazda chickpea dal. This is just um, it's veggie chickpea type curry thing, it's in a tin and it's free. I hope it's still free. <laughs> I checked it about three days ago and it still said it was free. So I'm assuming I should have checked. But yeah, it is normally free. So I hope it still is. I also got some of this. Now this was in and out of my cart on Morrison's. 
This is the Goo Chocolate and Salted Caramel Velvety Spread. Now, I had it in my cart, then I took it out. I thought, oh no, I really want to try it. And I think Irene would really like it as well. So I put it back in again. <laughs> and because the reason why it was in that on my cart is the amount of things it is. It's actually really high. So I thought like jam, it might be low, but it's not. So for one level tablespoon of this, it's actually four and a half things which I think is actually quite high, but then maybe most chocolate spreads are, I don't know. So yeah, I picked that up. So I'm not entirely sure if that was the right move or not, but we'll, we will see. Um, I'll get onto the stuff behind um, in a minute, but I'll just do what's in front of it first. I also got some of this VT Rice and Easy Long Grain. I thought that they were the two pots and it's not, it's the whole pot. And it is actually two things for the whole pot so i bought three of those thinking they were half they were the half portions but they're not so never mind now once again like i said to you about the freddo freddos this is how much things change this pot used to only be one thing not that long ago <laughs> um so half of them would have been half a thing now that's what i've been saying in my videos that the long grain but now it would appear that they've actually gone up in sin value. So that's how quickly things change and how you have to keep checking the app, even if you're not, even if you think you're 100% sure, it changes. So that's how quickly things change is that these are now more sins than what they used to be. So yeah, I just thought I'd point that out. And there's another example of it in a minute. <laughs> So anyway, the Morrison's Bolognese mix, I picked one of these up because the last Bolognese I made was watery. Now, seeing as the uh, pepper beef is one of these kind of mixes and that turns out quite well, I thought I would just try a Bolognese mix and see if that makes any difference. So one of these sachets is six and a half scenes, so I would probably get a number of portions out of this, four or five, so it'd be like a couple of scenes, maybe one and a half scenes each, depending on my portions that I get. I also picked up an impulse tea, don't know what it smells like, I think Irene uses this one, she said it was quite good so I picked one of those up, um, a Nestle Aereo, Aereo, I can't speak, Aero, <laughs> delightful peppermint, you all know I love these, I should have bought two packets but I only bought one because they weren't on offer, um, so these are, now where did I see it, I thought it would be on the other side, these are 27 gram. Um, so it's a pack of multi-pack of four and it's a 27 gram and these are seven things as you know I'm really I really like them I also bought some Morrison's macaroni just because I can then put it in my pressure cooker and it's like small and tiny and it will work in my pressure cooker but I don't find I don't know if the other sizes would work so that's why I picked that up I also picked up these, now <laughs> this is why I wanted the double cream, so I picked up some rich, rich fruit Christmas pudding, so I picked up the four of the indivi four individual ones and I picked up one big one. Um, now unbelievably, I cannot believe that it must be that one of these is 16 and a half things, like literally I, I'm shocked. But never mind, it is so it's 16 and a half things. Um, so 100 grams is what is in one of these pots, but the recommended serving is 100 grams, and this is a 400 gram size Christmas pudding. So, yeah, it would be exactly the same. So, I suppose that maybe I was thinking if I wanted more because everyone said how small these portions were, I could have. A bit more of this one but seeing as i've seen how much it is i'll be more inclined to have smaller portions of this because it's just huge so yeah so we shall see anyway so that's 16 and a half for 100 grams or if you wanted half you could halve it of the 100 grams and have 50 grams so i also bought some morrison's cream crackers because i have eaten my dad's one so but then saying that, that I was going to replace them, but I'll probably eat these as well. Um, so yeah, I picked up these. These are half a sim per cracker. I think that's really good, actually. 
Um, I don't know if any of the others are as low. I didn't look. I couldn't. Well, I couldn't find the Morrisons one, so I just entered it into the estimation app to find out the seams for it. Um, so I also bought some Special K Fiber Chocolate Delight bars. So I bought the dark and I bought the milk. This is where the, I've noticed something. Now these two both used to be healthy extra B choices. It is now saying on the app that this milk one is no longer a healthy extra B choice, but the dark one is. I don't know. So basically, if you were going to sin it, there'd be four and a half scenes each. If not, the dark one would be your healthy extra B choice, but you have to sin the milk one. That is what it's saying. I'm assuming the app is right. It, they both used to be a healthy extra B choice, but it has changed, clearly. So this is like several things now on this shop I have found that has changed. <laughs> um, and that isn't, again, that is something that isn't changed that long ago because I was buying these a few months back and they were healthy extra B choices, both of them. That's why I bought them. But they are saying that the coconut one, which my Morrison's shop didn't sell that, but there's a chocolate and coconut one, which is a healthy bee choice, which if I seen that, I probably might have thought about that instead of the milk one. But it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so I just thought I would tell you about that because that's another interesting thing. <laughs> so yeah, moving on to the next scene. So I bought these... Uh, Morrison's Christmas tree crumpets I thought they sounded really cute and I saw them last year and I didn't get them but I thought I would get them this year so yeah they look really quite cute and when I checked on the app they weren't on the app I had to fill out the scene calculator or the estimator and it's working out at four and a half scenes per little tree crumpet actually I think they're quite big as it goes at the size of my hand but I have small hands so yeah, I think they're reasonable. So yeah, I picked those up. Um, I also picked up some of the Weight Watchers thick sliced wholemeal bread. Now after all these changes, I probably should have checked this one on the app as well. But as far as I know, how it has been is that two of these slices are your healthy extra B choice. So that's what I've been going by. I can't see any reason why it would have changed, but then you never know. Um, yeah, so that is what it's another because I eat quite a lot of bread, so I'll just freeze that. I also picked up some of these Ritz cheese crackers. So this is quite surprising actually that a cream cracker is only half a scene, but these Ritz crackers just for one is one scene. So that's kind of a bit, a bit, uh, you know, I would have rather have just not bothered with that and just had the cream crackers, but never mind, it is what it is, isn't it? Um, I also picked up three ciders. None of them are on the app, so I think that probably the best thing is probably not to take my word for it because I don't actually know how many sins they are. Um, if it's going by what the lemon, what the not lemon, the strawberry and lime one is, which is sixteen and a half sins per bottle, I would probably apply the same sin amount to these three <laughs> to be safe because that's probably the highest sim value that I could find for the uh, Koppenberg ciders and I would probably just each one of them 16 and a half scenes if you're going to have the whole bottle because it seems to be the safest bet um yeah that's what I would say to be perfectly honest just to protect your weight loss you know and just be cautious and just think well I'll just do that. It's safer. Um, I also picked up some non-bio laundry capsule tablet things, family pack type thing. Um, two lots of paracetamol because I've gone through a number of packs because I was sick. <laughs> and then we'll move on to the stuff at the back. So I picked up some of this Pepsi match, just this normal plain flavour. Um, I thought I might try it with some Tia Maria because I think Tia Maria, the sort of spirits are quite low, whereas um, ciders are quite high. So I thought I would try that with just some normal Pepsi Max. I also picked up this, which I'm quite 
I'm hoping they're going to be good, otherwise I'll be really disappointed. Some Golden Wonder Ringos. These are the salt and vinegar flavour. They are six in a pack. And they are 12.5 grams per pack. So I've had a look at the app and there are different size uh, packs. So you need to check that what you're getting is, is that is the right one but 12.5 grams means that they're three things per pack i've checked on the app that is what it's saying three things i think that's really good so i'm hoping that these are going to be as good as the puffs and that i won't need to buy the puffs anymore <laughs> because i found something that will replace them because they seem to be getting harder and harder to get the salt and vinegar ones so we shall see we shall see um the Sprite Lemon and Lime No Sugar I've got. Now, I haven't checked the app for this because I'm assuming it would be sin free. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, sin free. So I bought that Sprite because it's sin free. I wanted more lemonade because I've been drinking quite a lot of lemonade, but um, I don't know. I usually buy 7 Up, but this is what they had, so I bought this instead. Um, I also bought some After Eights because I do. Kind of like after eight sometimes and these are let me see if I, i've written it all down here and now i can't find yeah so they're two things per after eight which is high i've got to admit for something so small that is really quite high i'm sure there's got to be something better out there but i don't know i'd have to look <laughs> um i also picked up my favorite pepsi max cherry no things because it's uh, got no sugar in it. And then onto some really, really boring stuff which I can't reach. I should have come over here to get it. I picked up some of my Herbal Essences Beautiful End Conditioner. I got two of those. And I got some of the Herbal Essences Crimson Orange and Mint Shampoo. This, um, I've, only, I've only ever used this once actually, but I thought it was... It kind of did give my hair more vo more volume. I thought it was actually quite nice and I like the smell of it. So I thought I would change for a bit and have this one. And then I also picked up something really boring. You all want to see this is the body form <laughs> um, sanitary towels. These are the nighttime ones. I'm sure you all want to see that. I bought two of those. <laughs> Um, yeah, so that is everything. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and also press the bell notification so that you're notified of every video that I upload to my channel. Thank you everyone for watching. Bye.